Hi everyone, I'm June McDonald Jenkins and I'm the Dean of Health, Human and Justice Studies here at Loyalist. And I wanted to have an opportunity to let you know what blended learning is gonna look like this fall in the School of Health. Uh, primarily, 50% or more of our programs will be delivered in a blended uh, methodology. So that means students will spend some time in class and of course, time in the labs. Uh, programs like nursing, PSW, practical nursing, baccalaureate, paramedic, fitness health promotion, will all be taking the time to ensure that you are uh, engaging in clinical-based skills and in lab skills in this environment. We just wanted to give you a chance to see the really unique things we've done to ensure your safety. So, as you can see from the lab, we've marked off designated lab areas so that students are able to come in and care for their patients in an enclosed environment that ensures social distancing from the students in the next uh, area. We've certainly made the labs smaller, so the groups are, have definitely been reduced to ensure safety, productivity to the public health standards that we've outlined. Students will be working in dyads and in pairs, so we can always ensure that we can uh, make sure that students are learning from each other, which is a real center point to the curriculum in, in the School of Health, Human and Justice Studies. To ensure your safety, though, we have to take a few extra precautions. So masks, of course, as we know, are mandatory, so everyone will have their masks on. But on top of that, when you're in an environment where you have to be with a partner and it's close proximity, you'll wear either goggles and or a face shield. If you have glasses like me, you'll want to put the shield on as well with the mask so that we can ensure that you are safe in the environment and you can still fully engage in the learning. Students will be ensuring that the areas are safe and clean and uh, sanitized after use. All the protocols have been laid out nicely for our students the procedures that have been put in place have been done purposely to ensure that we are adhering to public health guidelines. Congratulations on your decision to come to Loyalist. We're so excited to have you here. I can't wait to see you.